Hey brother, what you doing here? Oh, I'm not sure. What are you doing? Well, I've heard through the grapevine. Oh, and let's just fucking face it. The women of our community are nosy, and when you were asleep here, they look shit over. Apparently you got prophetic gifts and you know how to help people. I am a man who is humbly asking you for some help, and I'm sincere about it. I'm not playing with you. I'm not going to interrupt you. I'm not going to beat you up saying that you're queer like other people might like to do. I really am a man that is listening to you on your audio cast in your radio feed, and I'm wondering how can I learn from you so that I can move my life out of this poverty. I understand that you had a pretty good life before you came here, before you got hit by these people. You didn't quite get it, but I'm starting to get it, and I'm starting to realize that my life is mine, and your life is yours, and I really want to get the hell out of this situation. I just don't know what I can use in my skills and my talents to get out of here. Do you have time anytime this week that you could talk to me, or we could set a schedule to meet for lunch, or I could bring sandwiches, or we could go someplace and sit down, or sit down outside over at Culver's or whatnot, and we could just you could just talk to me. You could like talk to me about what I do or, or figure something out for me but I really need some help and I'd also like to know that you probably have to be compensated for that but I'm not a man of a lot of money but if you've got a really modest rate for a guy like me who typically works at this much an hour then I'm okay with that and I don't mind paying for the hour you know but don't make me a ball brow that be it I really want to get my life out of poverty and I really want to do something different in life and I'm not playing with you and I'm also not trying to take this in so I can take it off and pretend to be you because there's no way I can be you I'm gathering very quickly with everything I'm seeing, everything I'm listening to, all the details I'm hearing about your life and your past life, and everything you've done, and all the different things that these people have shown me, which wasn't the right to do, that I'm an idiot, and I need to say that out loud. I won't say that in front of anybody else, but I don't mind saying it in front of you, because you sort of earned my um, interest. You've also earned my respect and my regard, and I want to make sure that in America, people don't think of black people like me as stupid and hard. And openly, I don't want black people to be seen as foolish and impoverished all the time. I am a guy in struggle. I'll admit, I've got a little bit of money, but not a lot. I pay my bills on time. I live in a rented space. So I'm a little bit ahead of you, but not by much. And I want to learn how to get further ahead on me, on my gifts from God, on my abilities that I've gained over time. And maybe you can help sort me out and figure out what I need to do. But I'm not sure what to say to you to get to that point in conversation because I'm not a businessman and I'm not like you and I don't know how to do that exactly, but I am needing a little help. Do you have any time to talk to me for reals in a way that I can really make my life change? Because if I want to make myself a better man in front of a girl that I'm interested in and I need to have a little bit of extra cash in my pocket to do what you know men do with girls, I need to know how to do that. I also need to know how to be a good, productive member of society, which I'll be honest, I haven't done that. I've been lazy, I've been crass, I've been really angry, I've been pissed off, I've been racist, I've been a lot of things, but I'm starting to really get myself, and God is really changing me. Is there any time this week that you could meet with me and entreat me with a little bit of service, a little bit of a consulting, a little bit of just, I don't know, prophetic wisdom from God? And maybe that's where we should start. Maybe I should pay for a reading. Because I know that's what people do with you, and I don't have $350 for the hour, but I certainly can pay you a little money so you can eat. How do you feel about that? 